Most of you should know that the Jamshash icon starts falling at a gradually increasing velocity, which reaches terminal velocity really fast. In this screenshot, you can see the curvature of the trajectory of the cube turned to a line, indicating that the cube has reached a constant speed. Most also know that the black orb in Jamshash sends you to a terminal velocity in an instant. Keeping that in mind, if we fall into an upside down gravity portal, jump into it and hit a black orb, we will fall down slightly further each time. Look at the square each time we fall. It demonstrates how much we fall each time by going into this portal. A small percentage of this velocity is converted into an extra boost we get after we hit the gravity portal. Now while keeping that in mind, look at this clip from the 2.2 sneak peek. At first glance, it looks like an invisible gravity portal here. Next, there's some invisible gravity changes, and I don't know, if only there was some established way to telegraph that. Notice how the velocity after we hit the portal is way higher in the sneak peek than in the actual game. This could be a whole different portal, or it could be a neat feature in portals, which allows you to set your own preference on how much velocity is converted into a, a bounce after you hit the gravity portal. This theoretical setting could allow you to have way cooler and more fluent transitions with gravity portals, like we see in the sneak peek. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed and have a great day.